scones baked, house all tidied. Bloody cobweb. Oh, they won't see it. Oh, well, they might. Always washing her hands, everything in the right place. Poor girl. Not like a bloody mother's house. Had vermin tried to deny you, but I knew. Cause Charlie won't have a clue. Too busy on his phone in a world of his own. It tells me he's going to be the next Steve Jobs. Had to tell me who he was. He'll have to get a job first, bless him. Not end up a deadbeat like his mother. Oh, really, it's a worry, yeah. So caring and considerate. She thinks I'm always cross with her mother. <laughs> I tell her I'm not. Uh, just the way we are with each other. Such a worry, yeah. Cross? I'm furious with her. Doesn't listen to me. Thinks she knows best, but what the hell does she know? Why did we fall out, I ask? Silly, really. She accused me of interfering in her life. <laughs> Telling her what to do all the time, apparently. Didn't want me making the same mistake with her kids. Well, I think I'm doing a sterling job so far. I've been putting money away since they were born. Help with the uni fees. I'm leaving everything to them in the will. Thinks I'm trying to buy their affection, but she's just jealous, cos I'm not leaving her anything. Serves her right. Anyway, I promised them both some money when they reach 18, on the condition that they put it to good use, of course. Ah, oh, the sensible kids. Unlike their mother, squandering all their money on lost causes and promises. Well, they've not been for a while. Well, they're always on the go. School activities, apparently. Their mother got on me nerves hanging about the house. Sent her to girl guides. Didn't do her any harm. They should be here soon. She's dropping them off. She's busy. <laughs> I'll have them all to myself. Busy? She should get off her fat ass more. Go. I've made these with lashings of butter, their favourites. They look like they need fattening up a bit. I always say to them, oh, what happens at grandma's, days at grandma's, and <laughs> we laugh. Charlie tucks in, they only eat healthy at home. Ellie just picks at hers. Probably doesn't want to end up a beast like her mother. Well, they're both doing well at school. Ellie wants to be a chef and Charlie fancies himself as a footballer. If he doesn't make it, it as a billionaire tech company CEO, that is. Uh, quite the star player in Hartlepool's academy, apparently. Says he's going to make sure I'm well looked after. At least they won't waste their talents like their stupid mother did. Oh, for God's sakes, where are they? They should be here by now. She's probably doing this deliberately, punishing me, trying to take them away. Oh, at last. Oops. About time. You oh. pick a parcel for next door, please. Sheen delivery. Don't know why I'm bothered. 